Hey y'all, it's the Cincy Lady Bees, Texas. So a new year is upon us, and some people think it's hokey to create resolutions or goals because they're thinking, what's about a, a new year? Well, that's okay for you to have that mentality, but don't diss others that like the idea of a fresh start, a clean slate. You can feel however you want, but when you make others feel inferior about what they want or what they desire, that's not good. So my challenge for you as you head into the new year is that you go out and live. Just go out, be you, go big, and just do you. If you aren't affected by what somebody else does, then keep your opinion to yourself. It really doesn't matter because if they are dead set on if they need a clean slate, if they need a fresh start, if they need to set goals, if they need New Year's resolutions, you're not affected if in two weeks they flop or they lose interest or they lose momentum. You're not affected by that. So my challenge to you is just to stay in your lane. You do you and let them do them. Because at the end of the day, we have become a society that is just too comfortable telling people off. And honestly, it makes me really sad because I don't feel like that is a way for you to uplift someone. When you are degrading how someone feels or you are degrading how they choose to make a decision for themselves, that's not fair. Because everybody has their own mental way of dealing with whatever they're going through. And when you make them second guess if it's dumb or if it's stupid or if it's irrelevant, it doesn't matter because you aren't affected. You are not affected by what somebody else does, how somebody else chooses to set new goals or have a clean slate. Some people love the idea of a new year. So my challenge to you is as you are thinking about a new year and a new slate, think about just what type of person you want to be in 2021. Be kind, be nice, uplift others, encourage others. Because at the end of the day, some people are going through so much more than you could probably ever imagine. And how dare you question how they are choosing to deal with something. So you can think that New Year's resolutions are hokey or dumb or a waste of time or irrelevant. But at the end of the day, you do you and let them do them. Because goals are important, whether you realize it or not. And if you don't have goals, then maybe you're the one that needs to reevaluate because goals are something to look forward to. Goals are something to push you, to motivate you, to work harder, to stay engaged. Y'all, in the last 10 years of my Cincy journey, it has been like this. I've been on highs, I've been on in lows, I've been very engaged, I've been completely disengaged. I, I've been all over the place. But a goal is going to keep you interested. A goal is gonna keep you motivated. So if nothing else, set a goal for yourself for 2021. Whether it be personal, whether it be business, it doesn't matter. But at the end of the day, I just challenge you to be kind. Be kind to others. Encourage others. Go out and live. Set your goals. And believe in yourself. Because at the end of the day, you do you. Let them do them. Don't be so concerned with what other people are doing when you are not affected. If you are not affected, then your opinion doesn't matter to them. And it shouldn't. But when you share it with them, then they, they could possibly become consumed. Because maybe they have been beaten down their entire life. Maybe they have been questioned by every decision that they've ever made. And by you giving an unwarranted opinion or thought about what they choose to do, 
Maybe that just adds to the pressure of everybody thinks I'm stupid. Everything that I do is dumb. Everything that I do is unwarranted or unimportant or whatever. Keep your opinions to yourself, especially when they aren't wanted. Be kind, y'all. It's not that hard. We can all be better, do better, be nicer, be kinder, and we can all have a better 2021 by doing just that. Y'all have a good one.